Now, Sheena, listen, I am not messing with them local contracts. I don't care what y'all say. Listen, you guys can have all the local work that y'all can handle. I promise you, if anybody wants a local contract and, I, and the government calls me, I will give it to any and everyone. I don't want them. So y'all can have every local contract that comes your way. I'm not messing with local contracts. I'm going to, listen, the only reason, the only reason why the local contracting is still working, in my opinion, okay, is because Congress passed a bailout, right, that for the CARES Act, the $3 trillion that bailed out all of the states and all the local governments. If they had not passed that bailout, the local government would be financially strapped because of all of the COVID expenses and they would shortfall all of us contractors. That's why I don't support that. Yes, so we can, it's great that it's still working, but I tell you what, just like with the airlines, how, okay, if they don't get any more money, the airlines said what, they about to lay off 19,000 people because their money ran out? Same thing with the states. Anybody wants to take a look, right? Just take a look for your own edification. Look up the credit ratings for your local cities, your states. Look at their credit ratings. All of their credit ratings have dropped significantly. And without an influx of help from the federal government, they would be like choking. So because the government came in, bailed everybody out with a $3 trillion package, that kept everyone afloat, which kept everybody open and allowed them to keep paying us contractors. But I just can't in my heart of hearts. I would have never known that would have happened. So how could I, what if I told you to do local contracts and then they, the government didn't bail us out and then you guys were stuck holding the back? I can't have that on my conscience. So, and again, I gladly share one of my friends made, like made a million dollars profit off of local contracts this year during COVID. So again, I know it works, but it's just not something that I can teach to the masses. So I stick with something that I can teach, that I can promise with that if you know you do the activities, follow the process, that they will pay you and it will work, is the federal government. And so that's just my take on local context. But definitely, it, it, you know, they do work, right? They do work. And also, Sheena, like real talk, you got to have money to do some of that stuff, right? You know, you got to have money. Yeah, you're lucky, right? Because you, remember, I'm older than you. Well, I think I am, but I'm assuming I am. But again, I suffered in that 2008, 2007 crash when all the states went broke. I was there. And when they went broke and they couldn't pay, my friends were the ones that they had the, you know, they had the receivables for. So it was like, and all of a sudden, and even now today, even now today, I got a buddy of mine who's doing work for the school boards and they owe him money. And I promise you, there's probably, there's 27 people watching. If any one of us out here are doing school board work or doing state work, I guarantee you they're behind on payment. I guarantee you that you're gonna find people out here that's behind on their payments. It never fails me. It never fails. It's always like, yeah, they're 60 days, 90 days out. So that's the only reason. But no, I listen, I love it. I, I'm happy for everyone. Just look, hey, when you like just stash some money. So when you make them big checks, stash a little bit, make a big check, stash them, make a big check, stash them. <laughs> like it's just just stash, just tuck, just keep tucking because when hey, if they run out and they leave you hold the bag, you're gonna be like, ah, you're gonna be Eric. So, uh, I, you know, but hey, it's cool. What else? What else? What else? No, I know you would snap. I mean, trust me. They people be playing with your livelihood. They be like, your house be on the hook. Your cars be on the hook. Look, y'all ever seen on Facebook when y'all scroll that repo show? You be out on that repo show. They be right here in your car talking about they doing an inspection. Sheena, we're doing an inspection in your car. Could you just stand to the side, please, while we inspect your car? You be like, what y'all want to inspect my car for? <laughs> like, that's <laughs> <laughs> that's the way I see it. So, all right. What else? What else? I've been silly for about 10 minutes. I'm ranting. What else you guys got? 
what else? Questions. This is our last show for like a month, so y'all better get it in. <laughs> see this? In. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying to see it right now. Look, I got this old hot light over here in my eyes. You know, I'm sweating. I got to turn my AC off so y'all can hear me. Y'all better ask some questions. Sergio. <laughs> Nikki, has anyone ever been like in a play like when you were kids? Y'all don't remember being like on stage and they have all the lights? Like, I got all these lights. That's, you know. No, listen, trucking with us for life. You don't have to have the skill set. I mean, look. Again, none of this is overnight, guys. Don't be discouraged. Don't feel like as though if, you know, we're sharing stories that where we've won contracts or people that you know won contracts that it like it just because it happened for you in the last six months or eight months that it's not going to happen. I definitely think that, again, it comes with patience, right? I'm sure Sheena could share her stories that she didn't get her first contract like right off the gate. I mean, it just takes time. And, and so don't be discouraged because, you know, maybe you don't have all of the answers or you don't know all the right things to say. It, trust me, it comes to you. If you keep absorbing, you keep, look, you, first of all, I don't even think y'all understand. Like there's 30 people on here. You are already, the people that I'm talking to, you are in the room with great people already. Like, you do you not even understand that the people that I'm talking, like pay attention to who I'm calling their names. You are in the room surrounded by greatness already. So just even being on here tonight, whether you spent any money or not, like you are already in a company of people that are doing this. That should be enough encouragement and support. And if you look at their pictures, they probably look like you. So, I mean, take that to heart and take that back with you and say, hey, look, wait a second. Um, so look, somebody, a couple people, they're saying, hey, they, the source of thought is working. It's free. I'm giving out a source of thought thing for free. I'm telling you how to use it for free. Maria just made a video in Spanish in case y'all don't understand the English. For free. I don't even, like, we're trying to give y'all all of the tools to be successful. So let me, uh, let me tell you something. I'll tell you a funny story that just happened with us. I picked up a partner recently and uh, we talked about it. And so I, I was working, I was meeting with these guys this past weekend. And then when I met with, the, with these guys this past weekend, hold on, wait, I guess I see some people plugging in some stuff. So let me see. Let me scroll down real quick. Let me see what's on the feed. All right. Marcinda says, not having extra funds makes me nervous. Place my first bid. I have several supplies about supply credit on Alibaba, but they all said no far. Yeah. So again, I've never seen it anyone get supplier credit through alibaba but you, you know to get supplier credit you got to go through the companies directly so alibaba is a a portal that connects you with companies but in order to get supplier credit you have to get it from the people that are actually supplying those goods sounds like to me you're trying to sell something that you're buying overseas so if that's the case then i wouldn't sell that item because first of all it's too risky Second of all, you don't know the person. You can't go put your hands on them. Trust me, when your stuff is not right, you want to be able to put your hands on somebody. You want to be able to drive to their office, drive to their building, drive to their facility, and go see them when your stuff's not right. So I would not start off with Alibaba just because you send some people some money overseas and you don't get what you're supposed to get in a timely manner. They cancel your contract. Your stuff come late. And guess what? You're stuck holding the bag. So that's just not something that I would recommend. I would work with a company that's here in the United States that has a product or has a distributorship. Even if they buy it from overseas, I don't care. I want to be able to go to your office, go to your warehouse and see my stuff. Because when I get ready to ship it to the government and they ask for it, I got to come get mine. So I don't want to hear about the truck is late, the plane was delayed, some, the helicopter didn't make it. I want to go get my stuff. And trust me, I've done that before. I've driven halfway across the country to go get the stuff that I was owed the government. Because the people said they couldn't get it to me. No problem. I'm going to come get it. And I drove over there, came, got my stuff, and brought it back in. That's what you have to do. But if you order Alibaba, it's probably not going to happen. Hello, everyone. Eric Coffey here. And I know what you're thinking. Eric, how do I get more? And that's why we created GovConEDU.com. So visit us over at GovConEDU.com. That's the platform that I've created where I've curated more than a dozen plus courses 
on wide ranging topics from staffing, janitorial, to IT. We're discussing how to become a prime subcontractor, how to get involved, how to do simplified acquisition, what is a debriefing, what does that look like? I've taken all of my best of the best work that I've done and we put it into a collection of courses that are now being hosted over on the platform govconedu.com. So sign up today for one low cost subscription base and you can get access to more than a dozen plus courses.